Hey everybody, Dr. Nelson here. Uh, this is a video about multiplying binomials. All right, so the first page, you gotta follow along with me, so take notes. And then the second page, there's some problems for you to try. And then at the end, you can see how you did. All right, so to multiply binomials, you're gonna learn a famous method called FOIL. All right, and FOIL stands for first, outside, inside, and last. And this diagram really shows you the order of how to multiply the terms to get the product, all right? So F stands for first, and notice this arrow points to the A, which is the first term of this binomial, and the C, which is the first term of, of this binomial. So this would be A times C, which is AC. All right, to that you're gonna add, okay, O stands for outside. So A times D, right, because they're on the outside, say this is a house, they're on the outside of the house. So A times D is going to be AD plus I stands for inside or the inners. Okay, so now we're talking about the inside of the house. So B times C is BC. And then L stands for last. And in this case, the last terms are the B and the D. So B times D is BD. So that's the process of how to multiply um, two binomials. So let's try it over here. So let's write the word FOIL, all right? And so here we go. So we have n plus three times n plus six. So the first terms are an n and then an n. So n times n gives you n squared. Now let's do the outside. So n times six will give you six n. Now let's do the inside. Three times n is three n. And now last, the last part is the last, so three times six gives you an 18. And last but not least, you want to simplify. So we have n squared. Now the six n and the three n can be combined. So that's gonna be n squared plus nine n plus 18. And there it is, there's the product. All right, let's try another one down here. We have n minus five times n plus two. So again, let's write FOIL. And let's follow the order. So first, so it's gonna be n times n, which again is gonna be n squared. Now let's do the outside. So two times n is two n. And then the inside, so negative five times n is minus five n. And then last, we have negative five times two, which will make that a negative 10. Now we can simplify the middle terms. Two minus five n is negative three n. So it's gonna be n squared minus three n minus 10, and that's the, the product. All right, so now they understand how to use FOIL, why don't you pause the video and try the your turn pro problems now. And when you're done, hit play, you can see how you did. All right, good luck. All right, welcome back. Let's say I do these practice problems. So the first one, we have n plus three times n plus six. So again, F stands for first. So n times n is n squared. The outside, six times n is six n. The inside, three times n is three n. And then last but not least, the last ones are gonna be three times six, which is 18. So it's gonna be n squared plus nine n plus 18. All right, this one here, uh, n times n, again, is n squared. The outside, n times one is one n. The inside, negative seven times n is negative seven n. And then the outside, negative seven times one is minus seven. Now we can simplify the middle terms. So it's gonna be n squared minus six n minus seven. And then the last one, now notice we have a different we have a different coefficient in the beginning, right? So it doesn't matter, you still follow the same order. So three n times two n is gonna be six n squared. The outside is gonna be three n times negative six is minus 18 n. The inside, negative one times two n is negative two n. And then negative one times negative six gives us our last number, right? which is the positive six. 
So that's going to be 6n squared minus 20n plus 6. And there it is. All right, how'd you do?